Rob, Heath Mello and Gene Stothert both celebrating victories tonight and both already focused on ensuring another victory May 9th. It is a general election that could be very close. I understand that's an issue that's on everyone's mind. Moving on from the primary, moving forward to the general election. Mayoral candidate Heath Mello speaking to voters at Big Mama's Kitchen in North Omaha Wednesday. We're going to continue our campaign of campaigning in every area of this city because truly, as I've said, we're trying to run a campaign that unifies the city to build the Omaha of the future. Mello finishing behind Mayor Gene Stothert by fewer than 1,700 votes in the city primary, nearly the same number of ballots that remain uncounted. Stothert still confident she'll get a second term. Typically, uh, historically, um, those who win the primary go on to win the general, even if they win the primary by a very, very small margin. Candidate Taylor Royal generating more than 6,000 votes Tuesday. The question now, where will those votes go in May? Royal not ready to announce who he supports in a statement saying, quote, I'm taking time to reflect on the primary campaign and will soon decide my role and impact during the general election. Snother and Mello already talking with their former rival, hoping to sway his supporters. The mayor received only 44% of the vote, which meant 56% of the city wants new leadership and wants a new direction in City Hall. In the primary, we stayed very, very positive, and our message was positive. But in the general, we will certainly defend ourselves. As for those uncounted ballots, they include both early votes and provisional ballots. Again, about 1,700 in all. The Douglas County Election Commission says those results should be released Friday or early next week. Live in Omaha tonight, James Wilcox, KTV News Watch 7.